Hi folks, this is your handyman Pete Figgins. Today I'm going to show you how to repair a popped subfloor underneath a linoleum floor. Some of the tools you're going to need are a screw gun, some seam sealer, um, either low gloss or high gloss depending on what kind of floor you have, and a utility knife. Right now what I'm going to do is go ahead and find the spot that I want to repair. Uh, usually an inconspicuous spot. Uh, this is kind of a wood grain look so I can go right down the seam. And what you're going to do is you're just going to take your knife and you're going to score a small cut about an inch and a half to two inches. Then we're just going to work it up a little bit. get it loose then you're just going to pull it back just enough to get a screw in there let me try and set the camera down here see if I can get the repair done Like I say, I'll pull it back just enough to get the head of the screw right in the middle of the seam. Uh, I got a bad screw there. You don't want it right in the middle of the seam. You want it to be completely under the piece that you pulled back. You don't want the screw to be sticking up, but you also don't want it to be down too low because you don't want to leave a depression. Now what we'll do, just push it back down. Make sure there's no glue that's come through. don't want any lips. Then we're going to grab our seam sealer. And you can see the shape of the tip of the seam sealer. It's made to put this groove inside the seam that you cut. You just start at the very top, put your finger on the tip, pull it back to the end of the seam. Once that dries, you'll never be able to tell it's there, just like a good seam in the linoleum. It is a good idea that if you were to start your seam, you know, down here, instead of an area that is already marked, is to take a pencil, make just a small line, do your cut, and then right before you seal it, erase the line, and hold your finger at the tip so you know right where your mark is. All right, that was how to repair a popped subfloor underneath of a linoleum floor. I'm your handyman Pete Figgins and I'll see you later.